In this video I'll try to show two different ways in which I can hear Washora Mambo, a Matepe song played by the Zonka family. Unless you're interested in the harmonic system of this music, I recommend to turn off the screen and just listen. Each way of hearing has its own tonal center, from where the harmonic progression unfolds in a similar but different way. The first way is what Andrew Tracy calls the A standard sequence. I'm humming the dyadic root note of each step of the sequence. Now let's hear the same song again, this time from the harmonic perspective of what Tracy calls C standard sequence. <laughs> Let's listen to the full song. I'm humming the first sequence on the left channel and the second one on the right. With headphones you may try to switch between the two. I hope this shows how ambiguity within Nambira tunings works together with a self-similar harmonic progression, allowing people to hear quite different songs within one and to contribute vocal parts from their individual perspective. This is also part of why I believe Mbira music loses an essential quality when played in a diatonic western tuning. Thanks a lot for listening. <laughs> Oh, my God. 